When I gave him my trophies, Assi said you should be spending more time finding red. That bunghead isn't wrong. Oh? Meet me outside. I'm not going home. No. You want to help? Here's someone who needs it. Go ahead, Elsadi. I live in Lone Light, northeast of here. I barely escaped because Glint Hawks attack anyone who ventures out. We have so few shards. Sometimes member. How generous. In the past, I would have. What about Redmaw? Are you in or not? All right. About time All you right. showed up! More Glen Hawks incoming! That seems to have taken care of them. But more always come. The soldiers at Morning's Watch don't even bother to fight them anymore. It seems like they're coming from upriver. I could track them back to the source, but if more come here... I'll watch the village. You go ahead. I thought you wanted to do this together. You don't need me to hold your hand.
There are snap knock carcasses everywhere. No wonder the Glint Hawks were drawn here. Those blinds up there concentrate fire on a target. Makes it impossible to fight back. It's a cheat, and a wasteful one, too. Whoever did this must have left amateurs will leave easy tracks to follow. must be the snap. I'm here on behalf of the nearby village. Seems your kill zone is creating a Glintock problem for them. Yeah, well, they're not the only people with problems. If we don't get enough snap maw hearts to pay off a loan, we lose everything. I don't follow. I borrowed shards to buy seeds. The harvest went bust, and now they're coming for the debt. We could lose the farm, our home. I'm sorry about that. But Glinthawks are attacking people because of what you're doing here. Not my problem. None of us are leaving until I get what I came for. None of us? You didn't think it was just us two, did you? No one wins if we fight. Surely we can reach a compromise somewhere short of death? We've been harvesting snap maw hearts for days. I only need one more, and then I can settle my debt and save our home. If I get the last heart, do you promise to stay away? It's a good deal. Yabasha took a hard hit with that last one. Okay, fine. We need the shards. I'll do this for you once, and once only. Stay here till I get back. Another signal.
must be closing in on the signal. those hunters. There, the heart you need. Now what about your promise? A deal's a deal. And now I can pay off my debt. We won't be back. Good. Keep it that way. Aloy. Congratulations are in order. I wanted to make sure you could handle yourself. You were watching the whole time? Of course. Tarkas, may the sunlight is passing, taught me many things. First of which was, a hawk never abandons their thrush. Wait, are you saying... I'd like to sponsor you for membership. What do you say to hunting machines, winning trophies, and unseating a cease? <sighs> I'm in. I'll meet you back at the lodge as soon as I'm able. Talana, always a pleasure. I see you've brought your pet. Greetings, Sunhawk. I hereby sponsor Aloy of Venora for membership in the Hunter's Lodge. No. Look at her. She's lowborn, a savage. This is beneath even you, Talana. She has fulfilled the requirements. 
and Sun King Avad decreed the lodge should be open to all. Would you like to take it up with him? The word of the Sun King is indeed law. Even though it will bring ruin to the lodge, so be it. Do you, Aloy of the Nora, pledge to act rightly and nobly when in service to the lodge all the days to follow? I do. Members of the lodge, even though Tarkas is barely cold, I present to you Aloy of the Nora. Member and Thrush, what say you all? To the hunt! Sponsoring an outlander. <laughs> While you make meaningless gestures, I'll be finding Red Maw. <laughs>